My man's not a killer. He a hero. Go on somewhere. Man, she not about to let you see your mom, dog. Yeah, see, I already know when he when he run into her, she gonna have to catch the hands for sure. Cause she she played. To, do they have to be booty naked in there? Wow, that's messed up. That she about to go mess with the pillar. She is sick, sick in the head. I can't wait to find out her story and why she is the way she is. Oh wow, so she was controlling them. <laughs> dog, calm down. Dog, bro, like calm down. Hey, I just peeped. They show all five pillars right there. I just peeped that. They they showed all five of them right there. My thing is, bro, the Evangelist, bro, y'all already got two pillars, bro. Either give us show or let us get this next one. Like, for real, because right now it's uneven. Y'all cheating, for real. My my question is, though, in order to do what the Evangelist is trying to do, do they, they need all five pillars or they just need a few pillars? Man, this dude is obsessed with the Dola, bro. I can't wait to see where this shit goes, though, by, like, the end of the series. Like, how deep it really is. So I wonder if Shinra and Sho can basically do what those girls be doing. Basically how they be manipulating them in their brains and shit like that. I wonder if Sho and Shinra could do that. Or at least have like some telekinesis to where they can talk and communicate with each other. But Sho so far gone, I don't know, man. Oh. <laughs> so I wonder if his shit gonna set off. Like is he gonna have a link when he get nearer? That would that'd make the most sense. My man is in the suit though. He had to get cleaned up real quick. See, they they don't want to listen. They want to join too late. Uh, y'all ain't got nothing else better to do. Y'all y'all whole job is to to put out fires. So why wouldn't you go do something that's obviously gonna lead you to more fires to put out? <laughs> like what are you talking about, bro? You make it sound like that they, they really out here doing other stuff. Oh, he ain't be no. It's not. It, see, it's not that people become a lot more reasonable. It's just that we don't feel like dealing with the bullshit no more. Okay, we not about to. We we already see where this conversation is going to go. It ain't no point of arguing. Okay, so we gonna walk the fuck out and we gonna get this shit done on our own. Cause we don't we don't need y'all. Okay, we the eighth brigade. <laughs> we are the best brigade. Get out of here. We good, bro. I'm only more quick to... The depth and breadth of one's love. I will never give up on keeping the world safe. Ooh. There she go. Damn, so I wonder if she's just gonna, like, start going crazy. Her name Inca? Oh, wow. So she got that fucking smell on her like that? Boss Inca? She a gang leader? Dog. Shawty out here with the gang, though. So I hope it's a rich guy that catches fire this time. Oh, so she's smelling when the people catch fire. Okay. That makes sense. Damn, that's insane how she can smell when the, the fire's about to start. That's crazy how she can, like, just know when motherfuckers about to turn, though. So I wonder if she can help prevent that, if there was a way to prevent that. Oh, that's a fire, like an actual fire. She can smell when, like, an actual fire is about to take place. Wow. What? That's insane. All right, she said, hey, I could rescue you. I can get you out your own burning house. But I need your valuables. I need you right now while your house is burning down to run and get your valuables and bring them to me while your house is on fire and i'll rescue you that's smart you feel what i'm saying because you you really ain't got no time to think about it you like it's like if you don't give up your valuables nine times out of ten they're gonna burn in that fire anyways you get what i'm saying like all that money and stuff is gonna burn up anyways. Kind of smart thief, low key. So what are those two there for? That y'all didn't do nothing. Y'all didn't even go inside. First generation become infernos through human combustion. Yes. Second generation can manipulate and control flames. She is. Third generation can ignite their own flames and alter their force and shit. Are you a fourth generation? I don't know though because in the in the opening they show her doing like the little drawing thing to where like the fire is there. So. Unless they just did that to like as a symbol or something, but I'm pretty sure that like she can, she I'm pretty sure she has some power, bro. She was just chilling in that shit. Okay, yeah, yeah. Okay, all right. She got a she got a she got a fire high. She can get high off the fire. The flames get her lit. They really get her up. I see that now. Okay, I don't want to die. Got to get out of here. She came to she came to a realization during the flames. At first she. Oh, shit. Oh, damn. Oh, my God. They just got their shit blew back. And she just knows. Oh, wow. So exactly where any flame is coming from. Even so, whenever a new flame starts, she knows. She can see the route that the flame takes. Bro, that is insane. Like, bro, that is. If the Evangelists get their hands on her, that's, that's bad. That's going to be real bad. I need the fire force to get to her. But I need that other pillar 
to stop fucking with shit because I know she about to pull up in this girl's head in a minute. Ah, yeah, she can get out of her ease. At the time, I had lost an awful lot, but in return, I gained this power. I wonder, like, is she a, is she a whole different generation or would that be, or is that part of her? I don't know. That's interesting because I don't think anyone else can do that right now. Uh, yeah, yeah, she do got some adrenaline <laughs> junkie uh, symptoms in here. Wow, that's insane. Here comes your Adola link. It's over with. Be born. Oh, Bruh, this looks sick. Oh my gosh. That looks so cool. Yeah, she's bugging out right now. What was that? Oh, she is dangerous. Dangerous as hell. Yeah. Bro, I'm telling you, she gets high off the smell of flames. Bro, the fact that she can just pull up at any time like that is crazy. It's bad. It's bad. It's so bad. It's about to be a huge flame. Oh, wow. It's about to go up. Oh, yeah. She she loves that shit. <laughs> that's her that's her bread and butter, baby. Them flames, man. Them flames get her going. Oh, she got that power, boy. She can time that shit, too? Now, that's crazy. Yeah, see, now that's where it's weird. See, they looking at her like, all right, now, now, hold on now. Little, little, little Inca might be a little crazy. I mean, look, their valuables were gonna burn anyway, so I can I, I can honestly get over her taking their valuables. Man, this they about to they about to be bucking for this motherfucker, dog. Your owl eye, what is that? <gasps> what they out here with the VR headsets, boy? Come on, man. What we got drones now, bro? This man's Vulcan is the MVP, bro. What the frick? That is so lit. I, I am wondering how all those flames just broke out. Like, I wonder if the Invigelis did that. Bro, that shit is cold, bro. She out here with the VR headset flying in drones. Hey, this shit be looking cold for real, for real. Talking about making a fortune. You know I'm about to go hit all them houses right now. They like, hey, man, we just ordinary people. There ain't much we can do. I don't think she realized, though, that a lot of those people that she going, quote, unquote, to save have turned into flame people. Like, they not regular people that you about to go save. Oh, my God. She nasty. That's sick, though. Oh, my gosh. She looks so good. Gorilla radio, radio head. Incoming signals. Oh, she found her that quick? That's too quick, bro. Oh. Oh. I thought, hey, I thought them finding her was quick, but them getting to that location was quicker, bro. Pulled up with... Pulled up striking fear. He about to smack fire out whoever right there. Oh, you shouldn't have touched him. Oh. Oh. No, he didn't. No, he didn't. No, he did not. Oh, my God. He did not just do that. He just did that. Oh, fuck. All he did was reach back and blew his whole half off. This guy's dangerous. Oh, shit. Run, bro. Run, bro. There is nothing you can do. That's that dangerous looking for. What is his power? How did he just do that? No, you do not want to go with them. Oh, she about to go with them. Don't go with them. Well, what is this? Oh, she do got... Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. What? That is cold. Okay. So she basically... She drawing like the lines of her flame. But my question is, why did why does it start up like that? Start and go. So her power is just activated. Ooh, oh that shit is cold. All right, see, see I'm cause I, I'm I'm looking in the I was looking in the uh in the freaking opening and the openings be showing you a lot of stuff and I'm like, bro, she got some fire ignition power. You feel what I'm saying? That shit kind of cold. It say start to go. So I wonder if it like I don't know how it works. But I think it's cool how she can draw and connect those lines like that and then it just I wonder if it. And it's the, ooh, she about to weave that shit. Ooh. Ooh, wait a minute. Oh, my. Hold on. This is a... Ooh, she's cold. That's act... Bro, that is crazy as fuck. That she can just... Oh, yeah, she cold. Inca, you cold. Bro, I'm, why does her things act like that, though? Oh, uh, Shinra. Shinra coming right for your neck. Ooh. <laughs> that didn't do nothing? Wait a minute. I got hyped and that didn't do nothing. He just ate that. He just ate that. Shinra. Why didn't you put your Hold on, bro. Bro, why you come why you coming across like that? Why you say I'm taking you into custody? Don't say I'm taking you into custody. Say I'm here to protect you. Like, 
change your change your tone, bro. Yeah, see, you fucked up. You can't, you cannot tell a criminal that I'm taking you into custody and expecting to be able to have them to come with you. That's not how it works, Simra. Obi just told you in the car, like, hey, she's suspected to be the thief. Why the fuck, when you drop down, are you saying, I'm here with the special fire force, I'm, are you the fifth pillar, I'm taking you into custody? Like, what? That is not how you open up a relationship with a thief. Custody, anything to do with jail, does not go together with them. You should have dropped in and said, I'm the hero Shinra, I'm here to save you. <laughs> That's it. Nothing else. Not, I'm about to take you into custody. Like, come on. Come on, Shinra, you got to think. You have got to use your brain, man. You got to use your mind. <laughs> like, <laughs> you ain't never heard of manipulation, bro. Manipulate her. Not, not, hey, I'm here to take you into custody. That's not how it works. You're not taking her into custody. You don't have any proof that she's done anything wrong. And she a thief. She not going. Ooh, what the? Y'all not getting the fourth pillar, though, so. What? What the hell are they doing? Bro, dip, dip. Cause hey, dip, they over here. They about to go up in that ass, boy. Hey, go. I grab her and go. Oh my god, he got the hype squad around him. They just hyped this man's up. Why is this man just eating this shit? Oh my god, he was he's just eating these hits, bro. Why is this man so strong? Bro, ain't no come on, Shinra. Hey, you got the help. Oh, so he gotta get that grace. This man walk boom boom like what what yeah yeah okay I'm getting it so the motherfuckers with blindfolds that can't see is the coldest bro hold on man I'm about to start bro like it don't make no sense. It like sense ain't being made right now. Like man, he's gone and got he got on and got fired up, bro. That is insane. This man is cold, bro. Sharon, Sharon, you bombshell gorilla. Okay, wait a minute. Why you got? Um, I mean, I, I get it. The gorilla is like they be calling people gorillas in here, but we gotta, we gotta call the brother a gorilla. <laughs> To be con of course, bro. So that means next episode is about to. Oh, come on, let me just let me just go ahead. Let me go ahead and check. Go ahead and check out this. Let me go ahead and check out this preview, bro. Cause next episode is about to be crazy. Cause we. I hope Inca come with the fire force, bro. Like I hope she willingly accepts to go with the fire force, but I mean nine times ten she might get captured anyways. Cause yeah, okay, look. So she probably gonna get captured. Whoa, these new uh, that shit looks cold. Hey, the what's the name brigade come for us? Hey, ch calm down. Arthur about to get you together. Bro, so, all right. So, I, I think she's going to, like, I think I think Shinra's going to somehow, like, just from her watching Shinra do what Shinra does, she's going to want to go with go with Shinra. Probably not the Fire Force in general or the whole custody thing, but I think Jim, Shinra will win her over in some sort of way. But I totally see her getting captured by the Invangelists because I personally don't know at this level right now, currently, if Shinra is going to be able to defeat my mans, bro. Because Sharon, 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 whatever you say his name, the mans, I don't even know what his fucking ability is. But the dude's shit is insanely powerful. Like, he literally was eating blows from Shinra. He literally stomped him and dragged him. He dragged him around and flung him with his leg. With his leg. With his leg. Like, that is crazy. Do you think about you doing that to somebody? That sounds impossible. Sounds insane, right? Do cold. And so now I'm starting to think because when the girl actually hit him with her flame thing, it actually did something like it. it I mean, it ain't like, uh, it ain't make the uh go like that, but it it showed markings that it was somewhat effective. Maybe not strong enough yet, but somewhat effective. So I think her power not only allows her to sense the strength of like uh the 
the fucking sense of, of the flames and like where it's coming, the direction, how strong it is, whether it's weak or strong and stuff like that. But I also think since she can design her flames now, like since she got her flame ability now to where she can design that shit, I think she can target the weak points in someone's body. You know what I'm saying? Through the heat that courses through their body, I feel like she could sense where the weakest points are and hit those points with her uh, with her flame ability. You know what I'm saying? So that's just what I think just because of what I've seen so far in this episode. But, uh, dude, um, Inca Loki reminds me a lot of uh, Krona. Uh, Kr Kr I think that's her name. Krona from uh, Soul Eater. Uh, just from, like, their designs and stuff. And I can't wait to see if she has any, like, type Krona moments type... Uh, in this anime because there was some real dope scenes in Soul Leader that looked amazing with Krona. So, um, if we get some of those, that would be nice as fuck too. But, uh, dude, um, Sharon's about to have to step it up and I, I think Arthur is going to have to fight that girl. But, uh, bro, I'm excited. I can't wait to see what happens next episode. Like, like I said, man, I'm, I've been loving Fire Force since it dropped, since it came out and, uh, it has been, it has literally done nothing else but continue to heat the pot up for me like i have a pot full of water that is my excitement for fire force and fire force is continuing to light that pot i gotta make i gotta make all the heat and all the fire uh what the fuck is those words called you know we blank out sometimes you know what i'm saying but you, uh what the fuck man i'm gonna be thinking about it. now it's gonna be killing me um but yeah man you know metaphors i gotta think of all the flame metaphors i can puns i can while i'm doing this man but no y'all i'm enjoying fire force I'm really excited to see what's about to happen next episode. I believe four to six is like this arc, this arc, whatever this arc is called. I don't know what this arc is called, but this arc is supposed to be four, six, four to six. So, um, I think these next three episodes are about to be like really interesting. I feel like they're going to be real exciting. Um, and basically it's the war. It's the fight for the pillar at this point, fight for the fifth pillar. So, um, I can't wait to see. What the fuck these episodes are about to hold? This next fight that we're about to see in episode four is about to be sick as hell. I already know. Man, let me know. Y'all thoughts on Fire Force? Are y'all enjoying it? Do y'all love it? What do y'all think is about to happen next episode? If you know what's about to happen next episode, cut it. Don't even say nothing in the comments. I don't want to hear no facts. I want all assumptions and hypothesis. Don't come in here with your mathematical equations and give me correct answers, okay? I don't want that. I want you to guess. But as always, it has been your boy Orlando X the Great. And this has been Fire Force. And until the next video, I have got to go. Peace!